Greetings undetermined spectators of the World Wide Web. I am Tall Lanky Guy and welcome to, back to Five Nights at Freddy's. I told you I would go back and see if I can lay the smack down on Bonniekins over here. And by golly, I'm gonna do it. So, yeah, I, I realized that I made a mistake in my last video, which was not reacting fast enough to Bonnie at, at my door. And so, yeah, there's that. So I just need to be quicker on the draw. Like, bah! Don't, I don't need to hear this. Hi, hi. Hey, there we go. Mute call. Alright, so far, pretty honky-dory. You know, think that before the guy leaves, he would, like, try and clean up the place. Like, we got some, we got some pop, pop cups over here. We got crumpled pieces of paper. We got a freaking huge spider web down there. I don't know what that subwoofer is for, but, like, it certainly ain't being used for nothing of the security stuff. Where did he get these drawings, dude? Like, do kids just, like, draw things for, for the, 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 for the, the night guards? I mean, that'd be great. It did. But, you know, doesn't make much sense to me, honestly. Bonnie's still there. Everything's good. Everything's smooth sailing. Knock on. That might not be real wood that I just knocked on, so I'm still screwed. But, there we go. You know, so as soon as I see the guy in there... Oh, oh. dum dum da dum da dum I heard that dum dum da dum da dum 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 da dum I need to get that, that song. It's a good song. I can't quite remember the lyrics of it, but it may just be that the chorus is just dum dum da dum da dum So... Perhaps yeah. I need to start paying attention to stuff. I'm hearing some noisy news around. Like, obviously this game is very audio-centric. But so far things are alright. So far things are good. I'm at 79% at 2 a.m. Not exactly ideal, but it'll, it'll work. It'll do. As long as I'm conservative with my energy policies. Which, you know, not making a political statement at all. I'm literally being like, I need to conserve my energy. You want to quit singing? Like, I can, I can hear you. It's pretty obvious. So if you would kindly stop singing, maybe I should check on... Okay, Pirate Cove's doing fine. I heard that. That dum da dum was a little bit louder than usual. Okay, 2 a.m. Are things gonna start happening to me now? <sighs> hmm. Well, isn't this just an entertaining episode of... of... Tall Lanky Guy? I don't know why I would call the show that. It's just it's not the tall lanky guy show. It can't be the tall lanky show because shows themselves cannot be tall or lanky. It just doesn't work that way. So I don't know. I don't know, man. Don't even know. Uh, here we go. Oh, here we go. Here we go. The fun has begun. Where is he at? Oh, there he is. Okay. So we still got time. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna go into that whole movie reference this episode, because that already happened. I don't know. Use content. <laughs> Come on. Is he still there? Yeah, he's still there. A little, he's a little closer than I would like to the cameras. You know, hopefully he doesn't do anything incriminating in any way with his cameras cause me to not be able to see where he's at 
it's, I mean, I care about, I care about Bonnie. It may seem that I don't like him because he's, you know, trying to kill me, but I, I don't mind Bonnie. Like, he's, he's a pretty, you could even see in the last frame from, from when I, when he, like, popped up at my door in the last episode, he was just trying to say hi. He was also like, hey, I notice that you don't have a suit on. That's against the rules. You should probably go and put the suit on. Here, I'll forcefully help you. And then he, little does he know that he's murdering you. Move, move down into, no. Where's he, where's he gone? Oh, there he is. He moves fast. Golly. Oh my gosh, gee willikers. He moves quick. He's, is he still there? Oh, there he is. Okay, he's over there. That's fine. So if at any point those cameras go out, then I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna start closing doors. Because you can never be too safe. Unless you keep the doors open for too long, in which case that is being too safe. So you can very much be too safe. So basically what I'm saying is... Uh, that thing that I just said, that was wrong. The opposite of what I said was true. So, just accept that and move right on along. Bonnie is not doing a whole lot. He's just sort of hanging out by that there light bulb. <laughs> I mean, it's a very, so far it's very, very relaxing. Like, I've sort of... The, the jitters of being stopped. I didn't like that sound. But the jitters of being stopped by animatronic animals um, has somewhat worn off. And it's already 5 a.m., so I'm almost done. We're almost done. There's a light at the end of the tunnel. And by a light, I mean there's the little old brick. need this door right now. I am going to be very careful. Basically, if he's not there, he's not. You, you, you saw that, right? I really hope you saw it. Oh, yeah, oh. And... He's gone. Okay. Alright. Is he back where he's supposed to be? No, he's back. Where'd he go? Yay! Get out of here, fly. Second night. Oh, good. Great. Now we gotta deal with little Chica. Get, get, flies. Flies. I tell you. I would learn karate just so that I can learn how to do the the chopstick grab. Oh, hello. We got another, we got a phone call from our buddy training guy. I don't like calling him phone guy because he's, he's not just the guy that phones. He is, but he's so much more. Hey. Hey. Well, if you're here, listen, you made the day too. Heck yeah, I did. I, I won't talk quite as long this time since Freddy and his friends tend to become more active. Oh, so they do. Uh, it might be a good idea to peek those cameras while I talk, just to make sure everyone's in their proper place, you know. Uh, interestingly enough, Freddy himself doesn't come off stage very often. <laughs> I've heard he becomes a lot more active in the dark, though, so, hey, I guess that's one more reason not to run out of power, right? <laughs> just another uh, reason. I also want to emphasize the importance of using your door locks. Uh, 
Yeah. Yeah. Hey there, there Chica. Hey, I hello. Definitely where we start to hit a learning curve. I need to start checking on Pirate Pirate Cove over there. And Chikazoo Naboot over there. Oh balls. Oh, where'd he go? There he is. There he is. Okay, so I said I gotta start checking this light too. This one on the right. He is still there. He's still there, and Pirate Cove is still closed, and she's still there. Okay, cool. This is definitely this definitely means that I start using up more power, which can be rather risky. Um, yeah. Okay, people are still there. People are still there. Things are not going to crap yet, um, but they might be going to crap. That's very possible. Uh, this is the part where I start rambling. Okay, everyone's still there. Cool. Alright. I don't like that. I don't like it one bit. Alright, Chica's alright. I'm gonna quickly check on Pirate. And then go back. And I'm gonna start narrating everything in. None of that! I will not have it! I will not let you wrestle my jimmies. They will not be rustled. Okay, he's gone. Alright, where'd he scamper off to? Where'd he, where'd he, where'd he go? Okay. Oh, I need to check the right. Okay. Oh, this is where get, things get a little intense. This is where things start happening things and stuff oh I tell ya alright where are you chica oh I hear you rustling but you're not around could you could you show up what was that okay so there he is 3 a.m. 51%. We're cutting it a little close, but you know, that's that's okay, that's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. He's gone, that's good. He hasn't been hanging around a whole lot. There's Chica. Oh, I need to check on Pirate. There he is. Hey there, Foxy. Hey there, hi, hello. Okay. Alright. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. This is a great game. This is a good, good quality game. I'm just gonna start cutting these videos into shorter, into little increments, perhaps of best. No, not that. None of it. So sick of it. This is only night two, and I'm already sick of it. And you don't even commit to like the whole time that you're there. You're just, you're just like, you know what, I'll just be there enough to like, scare him, and then I'll just fall, cause I got stuff to do, I have to like, be all creepy and animatronic, stuff like that, it's worse, Chica hasn't even shown up yet, hasn't even shown up, hasn't even like, popped up to the party, She's a loser. In a bit of a loser. Okay, 4 a.m. I need to be smarter about my power usage because oh man, this is 
Cutting it close. I still need to check on Foxy. It's okay. Bonnie. Bonnie, you're really not. Did you, did you guys see that? The little flickering? The little Bonnie flickering? Was I the only one that see that? Did that make it into the capture? I really hope it did, because now I'm seeming a little bit nuts. No, I didn't want to check on him. <sighs> okay. Well, you know what? Night 2 is going just dandy. It's going just dandy going just dandy. So, yeah, nothing to worry about. Absolutely nothing to worry about. Not even going to be checking on the cameras for Chica or any of them, because I only need to use that for Mr. Foxy, the pirate. And... Also, my power is quickly running out, so, I mean, can't say it wouldn't be convenient if I ended this second night with a death, honestly, but, you know, we'll, we'll see how things go, we'll see. I tell you. We will have to do this in a later episode. Because ain't nobody got time for that. There we go. Okay, so thank you very much for watching. I am gonna continue and try myself at, try my hand at night three, where perhaps Freddy will make it an appearance. But uh, until then, you know, I'll see you later.